Ladies and gentlemen, come in, come in. In the mood for a story, are we? Our hero is no normal hero. Not even a hero at all. But a wee little heroine. Fully unremarkable. Welcome to the first chapter of A Juggler's Tale. An atmospheric puzzle side-scroller game set in a medieval puppet theater play. To create this very own theatrical mood, the game is divided into five chapters. Every single chapter starts and ends with a puppet stage. Once the player moves into the level and dives into the chapter, the puppet stage transforms into the stylized artwork. With a juggler's tale, we want people to experience the spirit of fairy tales in a digital environment. The game is full of references and inspirations from German and European fairy tales, which influenced us as kids and teenagers a lot. Come on, Abby, show us what you're made of. The first chapter is the tutorial to learn all the basic mechanics. But as you can see here, we also wanted to attract the player's attention towards the strings, which are not just a visual element, but also a key gameplay element for a lot of puzzles. The player follows the story of the little string puppet Abby, while always being accompanied by the verses of narrator and puppet master Jack. Fortune has deemed her artist extraordinary though not extraordinary enough to command her fair share. The ringleader announces proudly, Attention, the artist! A meager little girl child who alone shall confront the beast. Abby, my hero, I'm afraid I've dropped my cap. To the rescue, can Abby save my scalp? The narrator and puppet master Jack is always at our side. He drives the story forward and also comments on the player's actions. To support the mood of a puppet theater play, Jack speaks in a very poetic way. Most of his sentences are rhymed verses. As you can see, I jumped a little bit too early and Abby gets rescued by the Puppet Master. Situations like this create a very strong connection between the player and the narrator. Jack cares about his string puppet. He doesn't let you die, he just lets you try another time. Since this is the tutorial, we designed this puzzle to make use of the basic mechanics like pushing objects, swinging on ropes and throwing. It also becomes clear that Abby is an artist and belongs to the circus. Phenomenal, Abby! Do tell! The ringleader praises Abby. You've mastered that well! But the sun is beyond low, the audience beyond cliché. Good night, good people! was the last performance of the day. But out of sight from the cheering crowd, Abby's life is not at all proud. You had the crowd cheering for more! The ringleader praises Abby before locking the door. Held in a small cage day and night. Free only for the moment of a staged fight. At least she's not starving, which often occurs, but oh, how she longs to see the world. What's this? A pair of rats take heed and bring you an apple in your hour of need. Oh, poor, poor little Abby. Looks like we are not as free as we thought we are. The ringleader storms in, disturbed it seems. What's going on here? He stomps and screams. Being trapped with Abby is the start of our story, where her motivation to break free and discover the outside world 
has its origin. In order to guide Abby into freedom, we now need to steer the key from the ringleader. So let's finally steer the key from the ringleader and let Abby discover the beautiful world out there. Abby's had enough. Has she no place other than this cage? Off she goes, onto the wide open stage. Abby manages to flee from the circus, but will she be able to really break free? Our game is still in development, but we are looking forward to release a Juggler's Tale in 2021 for PC, Nintendo Switch, Xbox and PlayStation.